Hey guys, uh, welcome back uh, today in part two of uh, custom uh, keyboard. We will uh, work uh, to add next button uh, to uh, our keyboard. Also, we will learn how we can, uh, you know, uh, guide uh, user, uh, you know, entry between our text field. Yeah, always you can find source code. Uh, I will explain. Uh, yeah, let's uh, go to our project. I already made, made that project. So what I do, uh, I'll go to uh, source control navigator, and here I'm gonna add a new uh, branch. So the first branch, uh, which is master, was part one. So I make part two branch okay uh, and after this I'm gonna uh, save the rest in part two so uh, you can have a uh, starter for this also and for the other one okay so uh, let's go to our uh, back to our code so what I'm gonna do here uh, you know what I want to do so uh, we know that uh, let's go to the you know the current uh, not this one Sorry, uh, let's go to this one. Yeah, here's uh, our, uh, uh, you know, uh, current app. So we have four text fields, and uh, we can go to either and uh, return. But we want more. We want to, uh, when we return, uh, you know, we want to change this cancel to next. So when uh, we do cancel, instead of just coming back to the main view uh, jump to the next one and also for these uh, ones that don't have that uh, toolbar just when return jump to the next one All right. okay so uh, what we need to do so uh, my approach gonna be we know that uh, there there are uh, you know there could be lots of approach uh, to this uh, scenario but I like this approach that uh, we don't use any, uh, you know, uh, any framework. Also, uh, we even do, we do not use, uh, use uh, notif notification and uh, listener, uh, which is, uh, you know, I believe uh, more, uh, you know, in MVC design, model view design. Okay, so uh, what we do? Uh, first of all, I'll go to uh, my page. Uh, first of all, I move this uh, from center to top. So uh, I'll come to uh, my text, uh, my stack view, and from this stack view, I have uh, two uh, view. Uh, one is uh, central X, and uh, one is uh, central Y. So if I believe central X, I'm gonna delete that, and uh, I will say stick this uh, for me to top with uh, constraint of 10 yeah I think I think yeah I made a mistake it should uh, central uh, aggregate uh, uh, you know y should be deleted okay no problem I just come back here uh, to the stack view and I'm gonna delete central y and uh, add uh, one uh, horizontal uh, constraint yes uh, so now it's on top and we have this uh, space here for showing our uh, you know keyboard and still uh, have uh, you know access to the text field okay so after this I'll go to uh, one of uh, to a single of uh, you know uh, any text field and I give them a tag I already give them but I'm gonna show you how you can do it so here you will see uh, in view part uh, we have a tag number usually this tag uh, it's a zero or uh, is even empty okay so uh, I start with one I don't start with zero because all other elements even this label has tag value zero so I start with one <coughs> you can start with ten or whatever you like but uh, I start with one the second one uh, I'm gonna make it two and three and four yeah so after this uh, what I do I'll go to view controller and in view controller uh, we had a function uh, by the name of text uh, field shot 
uh, should return. So this uh, when uh, return, uh, you know, when we re come back from keyboard, this will run. So and right now we we say just uh, resign uh, from uh, responder. But I'm gonna comment this and uh, add these guys. So one by one, I'm gonna uncomment and we'll talk. So first uh, we will say text tag equal text field, uh, which is uh, the field active uh, field uh, tag plus one. Okay, so uh, if it's uh, one, gonna be two. Then we will find next response. So here you will see. I start from text field. I went to the super view, and then again I went to the super view or super view. So why I did that? Uh, let me show you. Here we are. Uh, you know that text field is this one. So we will go one level up. Then we will uh, be super view gonna be this uh, stack view, but this uh, stack view doesn't have other text fields. So I'll go to this stack view, which is super view of uh, super view of this text field, and from here, I say uh, view with tag. So uh, looking for tag number, which is the next tag number number two, okay, and. Uh, then I say okay if uh, next responder is not nil if it's uh, not nil yeah, actually you could, could find it so uh, then make my next responder be first responder so it's gonna be my active uh, uh, responder active uh, text field if not which is else what we do we just say uh, from this, uh, you know, text field and editing, and at the end again we return true. Okay, so this is for uh, uh, return for those uh, two fields uh, that we use uh, regular. But uh, we add, uh, you know, uh, one done and uh, cancel. Okay, so for this cancel, I'm gonna change all cancels to next. Okay. So I'm gonna command C here and control F for cancel. Okay. So uh, do you want do we want to change this function name? <coughs> yes, let's uh, change it. So I'm gonna say uh, replace with next. Okay. So I'm gonna ch replace this and on replace, on replace. Uh, sorry, on next actually on next next button next on next on next and this of course next and here add next next okay so uh, we done so we change everything to next but even if we change the uh, text but it's not gonna go to the next it's just uh, you know resign the first responder so here <coughs> uh, we add same uh, we add uh, the here uh, but a little bit uh, different that uh, you know here we uh, we are in ext extension so we don't have we are not in this view so we don't have we don't know what's the text uh, text field. so, so uh, our code try to find it out so we say okay from self because this is our UI text field I, I start with self which is the active uh, UI text field and I, you know find the tag and add it then uh, next one I'll go to super view super view which is gonna be main uh, stack view and from there I'm looking for view tag and here if uh, next was not nil what do for me uh, go to the next responder uh, and make it uh, you know become the uh, first responder which is active text field if not and editing And at the end, we're gonna return. So uh, we change our uh, this button, uh, this uh, text, uh, you know, function to do this action. Okay. Uh, so I want to uh, you, uh, show you guys uh, something uh, 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 how you can uh, debug your app. So what I do uh, here, I tag here and here and also I tag this one and this one okay okay so what I'm gonna do now uh, I'm gonna run this code 
and uh, see uh, what will happen. So I'll go to my, uh, you know, real device uh, and see what will happen. So it will sunk, uh, uh, function successfully uh, build and now it's gonna run it. Here we go. And here. Uh, we didn't say any active, uh, but uh, we will go by text. So uh, you will see that we have, uh, uh, you know, keyboard. So I tap on Reacher. So when I tap on this, it will go to here and stop. Uh, my tag, it's two. Actually, text tag. The next text tag is two. So I'm I'm gonna looking for that. So in the in where in text field, super view, super view. Uh, and okay, let me jump to the next one. So here now you will see that it, what it found. Uh, it, it's uh, let's see what it found. Yeah, here next uh, responder, which is one text field. Okay, uh, but uh, if you want, you can select this. Okay, uh, I'm gonna select these two, and here I say P, which is the mean print super view. Here we go, and it show me super view, which is one UI stack view, actually the root uh, UI stack view. Even if I say uh, next uh, responder, P that one for me, it uh, will show me what is that uh, responder, you know, as a JSON file, all the uh, information of that responder. And uh, here you will see that it is uh, one text field. Here you go. Okay. Uh, so uh, you learn how you can see. Also here I have all uh, variables. Uh, I can see the text tag field. Uh, what is the self and all detail text number. Uh, you know, phone uh, are my text fields. Okay. Uh, so. Uh, to be uh, so I'm gonna un uh, select these guys and uh, it will do the same for uh, in from inside of the you know for the other keyboard so now I'm gonna say continue so uh, I'll go to my mm, real device and you will see it jump to the other one. so I, uh, let me go back here and try so I enter something and then I say return. It will jump to the next one and open keyboard for me. Okay, uh, here I type a number and I say done. It's just come back and uh, resign it from to be edited. But I uh, just come back here and now this time I tab on next and you will see it's jump to the next. And in email I type something and I read done and here, uh, you know, now I'm in the uh, last one. Now let me return it. You will see I'm in the phone number. So here I enter phone number. But if I uh, uh, tab on next, there is nothing. So what we do? We just uh, resign, and uh, it seems we done. We can jump to if there is a you know continue, or if it, uh, if you want to jump to the next, we can say jump to the next uh, view controller. Okay, uh, so uh, that's it for today. Uh, something that I will make, it's a separate video, will be uh, controlling this. Uh, you know, we know that number should have a format, uh, email should have a specific format, phone number should have a specific format, even passport, I'm gonna add one passport. And uh, what I do, I'll give you uh, easy code uh, to uh, control uh, this and make sure uh, if it's valid, then jump, then you save. Uh, you know, bandwidth uh, from your server and avoid your user to give you uh, not valid uh, information. Okay, uh, that's it for today. I hope you liked the video. If you like it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget uh, to be subscribed. And if you uh, check mark that bell uh, beside the subscribe, then uh, you will be able to, uh, you know, uh, inform about the, my video. I don't uh, put too much video, uh, maybe uh, once or twice uh, per week. And if you have any question, ask in comment below. I'll be more than happy to help. And yeah, you can watch uh, next video if you like and if you have time. Have a great one. Bye. Bye.